Hello, hello, hello. Welcome. Can you hear me? Hello. Hello. Good evening. Miss, how's it going today? How are you? I'm fine. Hola, Alexander. ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo está? Cansado. Ay, sí. Sí, 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 sí. Dija. Dame eso, dámelo, 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 dámelo. Hey, hello, hello, welcome. Ok. Eh, hola a todos, espero que se encuentren muy bien, que hayan tenido un excelente día. Y si no lo tuvieron, pues mañana será un día nuevo. Así que eh, vamos a iniciar una clase más o una clase menos. Ok. Eh, recuerden, vamos a dar por finalizado este curso, este módulo, este viernes. Y es de mucha importancia que usted vaya avanzando en sus, en sus tareas para que no... Good evening, Mr. Para que no vaya eh, a quedarse eh, con muchas tareas al final. Y ¿okay? con un tiempo bien corto. Entonces, en la medida de lo posible, puede ir avanzando ¿okay? en la, las tareas. Recuerde que también esta semana vamos a realizar el, la encuesta... Okay. Y algo muy importante, no la vaya a realizar, sino que hasta el día viernes, okay, durante la clase, para que lo reservamos todos juntos. También de, es importante recordar que una vez hayamos ingresado los datos en la encuesta, eh, va a ser muy difícil cambiarlos. Entonces es muy importante que estemos todos juntos para que no, lo, no nos vayamos a equivocar. Yo sé que muchos de ustedes ya tienen la experiencia llenando la encuesta, pero eh, recuerden hacerlo hasta el último día de clases, que sería este viernes, si no me recuerdo, si sí, viernes primero. Ok. Entonces, eh, también recordarles nuevamente la importancia de las actividades, porque también eh, entre más rápido todos completemos las actividades, más rápido vamos a sacar los formatos de todos y más rápido vamos a iniciar el siguiente módulo. Ok, y no podemos iniciar el siguiente módulo si no sabemos si ya ha aprobado este, este módulo. Entonces, de mucha importancia también para, eh, con respecto al tiempo, para que no, por ejemplo, usted no vaya a estar realizando actividades el día, el día viernes, el examen final, la tarea 1, la tarea 2, la tarea 3, el midterm y el, y el examen final, sino que vaya eh, a su ritmo. Porque aún puede... Aún está tiempo para hacer la tarea 3 y el meter para que después solo vaya ya a finalizar la tarea 4 y el examen final. Okay, entonces les quería recordar eso. No sé si tienen alguna pregunta hasta el, por el momento.
Ok, bueno, el silencio autor. Muchas gracias. Vamos a tomar la asistencia de este día. Ahora es eh, 28 de septiembre. Ok. All right. Today, guys, we're going to uh, we're going to study the be going to be going to. Vamos a ver nuestra estructura del futuro. Ok. Cómo expresar futuro. Por ejemplo, eh, vamos a suponer que usted se va a ir de viaje. Entonces vamos a aprender cómo expresarnos en ese tiempo gramatical. Ya estudiamos el pasado simple, ya estudiamos el presente simple y ahora vamos también ya estudiamos ciertas estructuras de cómo ser más eh, educado, llamémoslo así. Y ahora vamos a ver el be going to, que es una expresión para el futuro. Ok. So I'm going to start taking the tender list. Vamos a ver. Vamos con Mr. Alexander. Present teacher. Thank you, Mr. Miss Brenda. Present. Thank you, Mr. Carlos Alberto Segura. Carolina Eleonor Cardona de Alvarado. Present teacher. Edgar José Cruz Amaya. Present. Thank you, Mr. Elvin Alexander Alvarado Díaz. Present, teacher. Thank you, sir. Ever Giovanni Ortiz. Heidi Marisol Menjibar López. Present. Thank you, Miss. José Nicolás García Maravilla. Present, teacher. Thank you, Mr. José Juan Alberto Rivas. Juan Ricardo Alvarenga Alas. Juan Ricardo Menedemo Delgado Vázquez. Present teacher Juan Alberto Rivas. Thank you. Kenia Rebeca Navarro Medrano. Kenia Rebeca Navarro Medrano. Present teacher. Okay, thank you, Miss Maritza. Eh, Ronald Alexis Gómez Mendoza. Present teacher. Thank you, Mr. Ronald. Miss Nora Lisset. Nora De Valte. Samuel Isidro Tejada Anaya. Present teacher. Thank you, Mr. Sandra Quintanilla Solano. Sonia Miriam Cortez Vargas. Present teacher. Wilmer Fabricio Morales Cáceres. Present. Thank you. Josué Isaac Gómez Rivas. Silvia Patricia. Okay. Good. Okay, let's remember a little bit about vocabulary that we studied yesterday. Vamos a recordar un poco el vocabulario. Okay. Okay, what was this? For example, extra service that the hotel uh, gives to the uh, people. Okay, what was the name of this word? I'm sorry? Amenities. Amenities. Good job, mister. Amenities are the extra services uh, that a hotel uh, gives to the people. For example, uh, what amenities do you remember? What amenities do you remember? Wi-Fi internet. Wi-Fi yeah. internet, excellent. Laundry service. Laundry service, excellent, Miss Carolina. Room service. I'm sorry, Mr. Alexander. Room service. Room service. Room Shuttle service. service. Shuttle service. Good. Okay, excellent. Amenities. Amenities. Extra service. 
Okay, how about this? It's a place where we can have meetings. Same the hotel. Business room. Business room. Excellent. Business. Okay, business center. But business center. Room. It's okay. Business center, business center, or business room. I think it's the same. Okay, business center. Teacher, and what is a business center? Okay, es un lugar donde se tiene conferencias, por ejemplo, un hotel. Okay, eh, y es donde se pueden reunir una empresa a trabajar. Okay, business center. Okay, how about this? Safe. But safe. 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 Good. Safe. Safe. How about this? Laundry, Laundry service. service. Laundry service. Okay, Mr. Wilmer, how often do you do laundry? I never do laundry. You never do laundry. Okay. Miss Brenda, how often do you do laundry? I do laundry uh, three, three days a week. Okay, three days a week. Good. How about Miss Marisol Menjibar? How often do you do laundry, Miss? I laundry every day. You laundry, you do all, you do laundry every single day. Okay, excellent. Okay, how about Mr. Edgar? How often do you do laundry? I do laundry three three times a week. Three times, okay, good. Okay, well, ah, how about this? W, um, accommodation. Accommodation, we can have two kind of accommodation. Uh, we have, for example, single accommodation or w. double. Okay. Good evening. Good, good evening. Okay, Safini. Okay, now we're going to uh, go straight to the manual, please. We're going to. Okay. Page 39. Okay, we have this conversation. Oh, I'm sorry. This, this conversation. And I'm going to ask uh, Jose Nicolás, okay, to read the conversation with Ms. Maritza. Okay, Mr. Nicolás, he will be the agent. And Ms. Maritza will be the... Rosa. Okay, are you ready? Okay. Okay, three, two, one, action. Mark Travel Agency, how can many help you? Good morning. I knew a reservation for MC Road. I'm going to travel to Coast Street of every. Catorce, mm. señor Vidado, ¿cómo se dice? Fourteen. 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 Sure, my have your name is please. Of course, uh, I'm Rosa Punte. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Mr. Puente. How long are you going to start? I going to start three days. Are you going to study in a smoking or uh, no smoking room? No smoking, smoking, please. Are you going to need the showering serving? Yes, please. Excellent. Good job. Okay, and two more. How about 
eh, Mr. Elvin and Mr. Samuel. Mr. Samuel will be, will be the agent and Mr. Elvin will be Rosa. Script. Okay, teacher. Okay, uh, Mark Travel Agency, how can I help you? Good morning, I need a reservation for a single room. I am going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14. Sure, may I have your name, please? Of course, I am Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I am going to stay two days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? No smoking, please. Are you going to need a shuttle service? Yes, please. Okay. Excellent. Good job. Okay. Uh, Okay, also we did this exercise, realizamos este ejercicio. Okay, y number one, Miss Carolina, what is number one? Yes, uh, um, number one, wake, wake up call. Wake up call, very good, Miss Carolina, good pronunciation. How about number two, Miss Sonia? Laundry service. Laundry service, excellent, Miss Sonia. Okay, number three, Juan Alberto Rivas, Mr. Number three. Is uh, fresh in room? Fridge in room, okay. Excellent. Fridge in, room. in the room. Okay, how about number Fridge four? Number four, Miss Marisol. Business center. Business center. Good. Good. Uh, number five, Miss Maritza. Number five. Miss Maritza. Okay, Mr. Juan Ricardo. I'm sorry. Okay, number five, Mr. Juan Ricardo. What would call? What would call? Number what five. Care, what would call? Okay, number five, it is safe. Safe. Number six, Mr. Samuel. Number six is single room. Single room. Seven, Mr. Edgar. Shuttle service. Shuttle service, good. And finally, number eight, uh, Miss Brenda. Wi-Fi in and out. Wi-Fi in and out, good. Okay, also then you did your own checklist. Okay, en esta ustedes compartieron los elementos que a usted le gustaría tener. Okay, the amenities, amenities. Así que vamos a compartir lo que usted hizo el día de ayer con nuestros compañeros. Vamos a realizar en breakout rooms. Y usted tiene que compartir eh, con, sus, con su compañero y después eh, the other way around. Ok.
Job visita fue room service, laundry service, tour guide, wifi, no, wifi o wifi, wifi, eh, vea. Wifi mm -hmm. internet y spa service. Spa service. Da. Spa service. Ay, sí, teacher, un spa. <risa> Me lo merezco, teacher. <risa> Excelente mes. Todos necesitamos un masaje en esta época. No, ya cuando el fin de semana que terminemos el, el, el ¿cómo se llama? El curso, me voy a ir, una amiga ha abierto un, un lugar de spa y voy a ir. Excelente, Miss. Ay, sí, teacher. I envy you. Ay, sí, le voy a, ahí le voy a mandar el contacto de ella. Si viven cerca, la van a encontrar, ahí en la colonia Centroamérica creo que está. Por el Torogos, ¿verdad? Ajá, por el Torogos. Ajá, okay. yo lo voy a ir a probar a ver qué tal, porque una vez fui a un spa y me dejaron mayugada, me pasé tomando como cinco días una ibuprofeno, porque la persona que me lo hizo me, me torturó la espalda, ay, no podía ni acostarme, me dejó Era mal, peor. mal, sí, esa vez sí me fue mal, muy mal. Yo fui hace como, hace como un mes ah. a un lugar, pero de masaje de ciegos. Porque eh, ah, dicen que esos son lo mejor, dicen. Eh, tanto estrés había quedado adolorido de una parte de acá y no podía mover el cuello. Entonces Ay. ya no aguantaba, ya era demasiado. Fui y el señor me apretaba como que, o sea, me dolía bastante, pero era como un dolor satisfactorio. ¿me entiendes? Ah, ajá, ajá. Y se me, se me quitó el dolor. O sea, así después que me sobo, se me quitó. Teacher, dicen que esa, esas personas hacen unos masajes que en verdad sí, o sea, como que ellos saben más, dicen, o sea, no lo hacen por, como por... Solo sobarlo. Ajá, sino que dicen que ellos conocen la, las partes donde, donde más le duele a uno, qué sé yo, las terminales donde no, no tocan el músculo, no sé, no sé qué fue lo que me explicaron. Qué chivo. ¿Y por dónde es, teacher? Ahí por la Bernal, arriba de la Central América. Ah, Ahí ah, en la esquina bien. está. Ah. Si, usted conoce, si usted conoce el semáforo de la Bernal. Sí, eh, sí, pero el que, el que está de las Isimiles, ah, de ah, la Bernal, ah, dice. Vea. De las Isimiles, recto. Ajá. Buscando. Al hospital militar. Ajá, antes de llegar al hospital militar. Por donde está el, el, el Instituto Betel. Antes todavía de Betel. Ah. Ahí hay como un bien. centro comercial a mano derecha, ahí. Recomendado, mis. ¿Dónde está hoy el Dollar City? ¿Dónde antes era? Después el, del Dollar City. El... Justo después del ah. Dollar City. Se pasa a la calle y ya está ahí. Exacto, pues lo voy a ir a buscar. Lo voy a ir a... Voy a probar con esta amiga porque, porque sí, la verdad, lo necesito. A, ayer, <risa> toda la semana y el fin de semana he dormido súper mal y ayer me acosté a la una y algo como a las dos de la mañana porque mi esposo está viniendo demasiado tarde de trabajar y, y es mentira, yo no me puedo dormir si él no está aquí, es difícil que yo concilie el sueño y, este, y, y se está levantando a las 5 porque tiene que estar nuevamente a las 6 de la mañana en el trabajo y él no se queda allá porque yo le he dicho que es prohibido que no venga a la casa, si aunque sea una hora <risa> tenés que venir a verme, le digo porque yo no puedo estar sin verte, le digo así que tenés que venir Así que he estado sufriendo. Y hoy dormí toda la tarde, no saben, toda la tarde dormí del cansancio. Y como yo soy pastelera, me dedico a hacer pasteles en las noches. Entonces he, había tenido mucho trabajo, gracias a Dios. Así que Qué bueno. Voy a, he, ahor he ahorrado para eso, <ríe> para el <día> spa. <ríe> Excelente. También tenemos que probar esos pasteles. Sí, teacher. El día que estemos presenciales es una promise, pinky promise. Aquí ven que, pinky promise, pinky, pinky promise. promise. Yes. <ríe> Vaya. Nosotros ya hicimos el, voc el vocabulary, ¿no? Uh -huh. La checklist, checklist.
perdón, o sea, con el micrófono. Ok, vi que ya crearon su checklist. Eh, algunos de ustedes han agregado eh, unos services, unos amenities muy curiosos, ok. Pero los más comunes, Wi-Fi, Air Conditioner, también vía por ahí, eh, free beverage, bebidas gratis, free beverage, all you can eat, ok. Buffet, excellent, ok, but we're going to listen to you, vamos a escucharlos. Uh, let's begin with Mr. Alexander and Mr. Ronald, please. Wi Fi internet, home service, health service, team access, fresh beverage, laundry service. Las mías fueron air conditioning, Wi Fi internet, single room, shuttle service, and fridge in the room. Thank you, Mr. Okay, how about Mr. Edgar and Miss Sonia? Okay, in my case, if I need a reservation cell, I would like to have a double room, and also I would like to have a, a gym, a bar. I would like to have a buffet service, and also the shuttle bus the air conditioned room and the um, the laundry and the Wi-Fi internet. internet. Excellent, good job, okay. Tenemos un equilibrio, bar and gym, good job. Okay, uh, how about Miss Sonia? Um, in my case, my amenities, my amenities are Double room, Wi Fi internet, transportation to downtown city, air conditioner, room service, double bed, and non smoke room. Excellent, non, -smo non smoking room. Very good. How about Mr. Juan Ricardo Menevemo? Ladri Serbi, Simon Paul, Vidri Serbi, Why, why Interim, Justi Serbi, Finish Room, Michael Ucol, Sigler Room, Sister Center, Sophie, Hau Chau, Tar Coffee, a restroom. A rated bound year road amount. Okay. Laundry, very good. Okay, a lot of services, Mr. Thank you very much. How about Ms. Maritza Reyes? Bigati, BC Shopping Center, we in with inter internet. Finish. Internet, okay, or internet. It's okay, Miss. Only that? Okay, let's continue. Let me see. With Miss, Miss Carolina. Yes, my checklist is room service. Laundry service, tour guild, wife, wi fi, internet, spa service. Okay, spa, good. Okay, to get relaxed, you see? Excellent. Good job. Okay, and how about Mr. Samuel? Uh, okay. AC room service, laundry service, and Wi Fi internet. Wi Fi internet. Good. Okay. Thank you very much for your participation. Okay. Now let's continue in the manual. Okay. In the manual, vamos a encontrar una conversación. Okay. In la página 41, page 41. 
Okay, make a hotel reservation and request related service. Request es como solicitar o pedir. Request. Okay. Uh, it says, listen to your teacher, read the conversation, then practice with a partner, a phone call to a hotel. It says, uh, hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure, may I have your name, please? Of course, I'm, I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Ok. Voy a volver a leer. Ok. Y dice. Hello. Thank you for calling the Golden Stars Hotel. This is Jane. How can I help you? Hello. I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or double room? A single room, please. Okay, as usual, uh, any question about the pronunciation of any word or the definition or the meaning of any word? Teacher, me. Diga, mister. I got a question. For example, if we have the, if I have the opportunity to talk by phone, uh, can I say we are in the, this class is about be going to, right? Yep. Can I say in, in the line when say thank you mr gomez when are you going to arrive can i say when are you gonna arrive when are you gonna yeah the thing is that you're using you are using contraction but contraction it's right it, it's right yeah when we speak we can use gonna okay. no, no problem I... no there isn't any problem when are you gonna when are you going when are you going to arrive yo yo porque quizás lo puede empezar como que es slang o es que vaya mister eh, solo para explicar eh, el gonna como usted sabe es, es algo informal verdad que sí es popular pero que no es un no es inglés formal entonces lo primero que yo le tengo que enseñar es el inglés formal verdad Porque eso usted va a ser entendido en cualquier parte. Y usted va a entender en cualquier parte. Eh, entonces, sabemos que going to es la forma formal. Pero si usted, está, si usted puede utilizar gonna su, eh, correctamente, está bien. Porque se utiliza a la hora de hablar. Okay. Okay, solo que cuando utilizamos gonna, tiene que pronunciar, tiene que pronunciar el verb to be. Porque no solo es when gonna arrive, ¿verdad? sino que when are you gonna arrive. Es solamente como advice. ¿Ok? Pero yo entiendo su punto, mister. Ok, thank you. Ok. Eh, I don't know if you have any question about another word. Otra palabra en la pronunciación, el significado. Si... Si no quiere activar su micrófono, puede escribir en el chat. Y aquí, de forma anónima, vamos a, a darle eh, solución. ¿O todo está claro? ¿Arrive? ¿Significa? Llegar. 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 Muy bien. Llegar. Arrive. For example, uh, Mr. Alexander, what time do you arrive at your home? What time do you arrive at your home? I arrive at my home on 6 p.m. 
6 p.m. Good. Miss Marisol, what time do you arrive at your home? Sorry, sorry. What time do you arrive at your job, Miss Marisol? Um, um, I get to to the six six o'clock. Okay, at six at six o'clock. At six o'clock. Very early, muy tem bien temprano, Miss. Okay. Yes, yes. Excellent. Antes antes de Caroline. Ah. Ok, aquí, ok, muy bien. Entonces, eh, según veo, está todo claro en cuanto al significado de las palabras y la pronunciación. En este caso, going to es para ir un, pero que en futuro, ¿verdad? Pero es formal o informal. Formal, Richard. formal, mister. Formal, ya, ya, vamos, ya vamos a llegar a la parte. Cuando se... Ya vamos a llegar a la parte de la explicación de gramática. Entonces, ahorita vamos a enfocar en la pronunciación, el significado y la, y la conversación. Después de esto vamos a explicar el, el Bitcoin. Ah, y en el caso del Wilma, eso también es válido. Válido también. Mm, Pero ¿cuál es la diferencia entre going to y el will? Eh, going to es, por ejemplo, cuando se dice en español... Yo voy a ir a Estados Unidos. Y el will es como yo iré. Es como ir, iré, sí. como Ajá. forma de duda. Yo iré a la playa el siguiente sábado. Ah. Ok. Y no es lo mismo que diga yo voy a ir a la playa. Ok, pero ya lo vamos a ver mm. la diferencia, mister. Ok, ahorita vamos a practicar la ah, conversación. Es, eso como subjuntivo, dice usted. Pues no sé en realidad cómo se llamará en español, pero después vamos es a explicar. Subjuntivo. Ok, bueno, vamos a eh, practicar la conversación. Ok, de la página 41. Ok, there we go. Ok, ya me está cargando. Ok, eh, ¿cómo dijimos quién va primero? Usted primero. Ah, ok. Hello, thank you for calling the Golden mm -hmm. Star Hotel. This is Jane. How can I help you? Hello. I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I be Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? 
a single a single room please to make a reservation sure my i have your name please of course i'm gerardo gomez thank you mr gomez when are you going to arrive i come to arrive on friday for um 14 14 <laughs> How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for single or a double room? A single room, please. Okay. Otra oh. vez. Entonces, uh -huh. cuando decimos us, es nosotros. Us. Uh, ¿A dónde? Us. Aquí dice, how long are you going to stay? La cerveza, Golden. Golden, ok. Start hotel, hotel o hotel? Hotel. Hotel, this is Jim, how can you help him? Can okay. I Hello, that you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is for can I help you. Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure, may, may, may I, I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. Where are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14. For, for, for long are you going to start with your Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay aside until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for I single or 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 I do 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 home. a single room, please. Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jim. How can I help you? Hello, and I need to my I the bedroom. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of, of course, I am Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on the day 14. How long are you going to stay with, without Mr. Gomez? I am going to start on the Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or double room? I a single room, please. Okay. Finish. Thank you, Excellent. Bye. <clears throat> Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive?
Okay, welcome. Okay, uh, let me see. I'm going to choose some volunteers to read the conversation. Okay, how about... Uh, okay, we have volunteer. Okay, thank you, Miss Carolina. Me, teacher. Okay. <laughs> Entonces, okay, Miss Carolina, yeah. then uh -huh. Mr. Alexander's group, and then Miss Brenda's group. Okay, entonces okay. con Juan Alberto. Okay, me lo escuchar. Sí, sí perfecto. Okay. Okay. okay, hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jane. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course, I am Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I am going to arrive to, on Friday 14. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I am going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or double room? A single room, please. Okay. Okay, now Mr. Alexander Aron, please, and his classmate. Okay, I'm a star. Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Edgar, how can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I am Alexander Donio. Thank you, Mr. Alexander. When are you going to arrive? I want to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Alexander? I am going to stay until Monday. Okay. Are you going to make a reservation for a single or double room? A single room, please. Okay, no problem. Good. Uh, now, Miss Brenda's group, please. Okay. Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jim. How can I help you? Hello, I I need to my I res I reservation. Sure, may I have your name, please? Oh, of course, I am Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Miss. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I going to arrive on Friday fourteen. How long are you going to stay with us, Miss Gomez? I'm going to start on day Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or double room? A single room, please. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, and let's end it up. We're going to finish with Mr. Menelemo and Mr. Elbe. Okay. Hello. Ah, ¿Qué empieza usted? Empieza usted, dele. Siga. Hello. Thank, thank you for calling a uh, Golden Star Hotel. It is Joe Akin Hall. You. Hello. I need to make a, a reservation. Sure, may I have you my name, please? Of course, I am Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going a river? I am going to arrive on the Friday 14. How long are you going to stay with host, Mr. Gomez? I am going to stay until Monday. How are you going to make a reservation of our sickly don't? City room. 
A single room, please. Okay. All right. Thank you very much. Good job. Okay. Ahora vamos a ir al ejercicio 3. Y dice que en el ejercicio 3 vamos a rellenar, vamos a completar la información eh, de la... Vamos a completar eh, la información de la conversación y, des, y comparar con nuestros compañeros. Por ejemplo, what is the agent's name? Jen. Jen. Jen, ok. Who is uh, the guest, or oh, what is the guest name? Gerardo Gómez. Gerardo, Gerardo Gómez. Gómez. What time, what time, or it is the check-in. Check-in es la hora de llegada. Friday 14, pero no hay hora. Uh, he, he didn't say, okay, in the checkout. Monday. Uh, Monday. On the Monday. 16th. Excellent. Okay, is it single room or double room? Single room. Single room. Single room. Single room. Okay. Good. Okay, ese es un formato eh, que tiene, bueno, usualmente se utiliza para rellenar la información de la persona que está haciendo la reservación. Okay. También tenemos, would you like for a very polite request? Need and want are also possible, but less polite. Como habíamos dicho en la unidad pasada, cuando utilizamos would like, porque estamos solicitando algo de una forma muy educada. Sin embargo, usted puede, usted puede eh, usar need and want, pero es menos polite, less polite. Por ejemplo, usted puede decir, I would like to make a reservation. Suena muy, suena bastante educado okay, o formal. Sin embargo, también puede decir, I need to make a reservation. Ok. Eh, now, vamos a poner bastante cuidado en este formato. Ok. Because. Ok. Because. Oh, sorry. Ok. It will be, it will be your turn. Ok. So the students must pretend that they are calling a hotel. I need to get information or make a reservation. Ok. Eh, van a, esta vez, van a crear su, podemos llamarlo diálogo. Donde tienen okay. que pretender que usted está llamando a un hotel. Puede ponerle el nombre del hotel como el, el cuadrito, ¿verdad? Que, que visualizamos previamente. Y va a, va a hacer una reservación o, una, o va a solicitar información para reservar. Que ahí hay dos posibles escenarios. Okay. ¿Qué es lo que va a solicitar? Por ejemplo, el agente va a solicitar el nombre del cliente, a qué hora va a ser el check-in, cuántos días va a estar, eh, si necesita un servicio extra, amenity. Ok. Ok, y trate de utilizar expresiones como would, eh, I would like to make a reservation or may I have, okay, como la conversación. Ok. Vamos a crear nuestra propia conversación donde solicitamos información para hacer una reservación o vamos a hacer una reservación a un hotel.
sería, digamos, eh, eh, sería como tú, sería el, el, como que el, el, el saludo. El Ajá. Good morning. Ajá. A manager motel, how can I help you? Sería el, el, sería el, 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 el ¿Cómo dice que le pusiste al, al, al hotel? Amanecer. Motel. Amanecer feliz. Amanecer feliz. Amanecer feliz. Happy ah. waking up. Ah, happy waking up. Okay. Happy no, no, pero como es un nombre propio, puede mantenerlo en español, mister. Ah, ok. Amanecer feliz. <risa> ok. Entonces sería el saludo. Eh. Good morning. Eh, amanecer feliz motel. It is motel, no hotel. hotel. Ah, it is. Perdón, maestro. ¿Es motel o hotel? <risa> motel. Ok, motel. Okay, se dice motel. <risa> Motel, ok, motel. Vaya, vaya, sería como el que conteste, I need one reservation, sería, va. Amanecer. I need one reservation. It can help you. Pero ahí le van a decir, ¿cuánto, ¿qué quiere usted? ¿Cuántas horas va a estar? <risa> <risa> Pues pensaba yo, how many rooms you need? Algo por ejemplo. Sí, va. La sería, va. How many rooms? Eh, después yo te respondré diez, a Nicolás. Uh -huh. Nicolás, yo te voy a decir. Eh, hello. I need to, I need, I, I would, I would like to make it special. Sería, I would need, no sería. No, I would, I would like. I would like. Me gustaría oh. reservar. Excelente, mister. I would like to make a reservation. I would like. I, I would like to, uh, to hello. Make. May, uh -huh. hello. Hello. I would like. Uh -huh. I would like to make the reservation. Uh -huh. For this is night. Uh -huh. For this is night. Oh, by this is night, sería verdad, maestro, si es para. For this night. For this night, okay. Porque en qué momento podemos utilizar by teacher. Perdón. ¿En qué momento podemos utilizar el, la preposición by? By. By. Eh, ¿no? Bueno, hay ciertas. Eh, ciertas preposiciones que ya están como para ciertas frases uh -huh. pero by, fue, ¿no? by es, usualmente es eh, para enfatizar el, alguien, lo que es la persona que está realizando la acción como en el passive voice y uh -huh. también eh, pero en este caso para decir noche no, no, sé, no, no va by this night no se puede no se puede ok por this night ok Ajá, ¿qué sería después? Sí. Hello, would you like to the Ah, uh, how many rooms you need? 
of how many room need to run in night and a meet. No, this is steady, yeah, okay. Who money? Who money? Room need. Hola, hola. Ok. Entonces. Eh, are you. Are you going to make. Eh, tal vez ahí para variar le podemos poner. Are you going to. Go make. Uh, are you going to make. The reservation. Reservation for smoking or no smoking room. Entonces, lo podríamos ahí con. Are you going to make a. O le dejamos siempre como la. For single or double room. Okay. ¿Qué me diría usted? Um, yo le diría, bueno... A double room, double room, please. Tal vez le preguntaría como... Ajá, yo le diría... Como otro servicio que necesite. Aparte. Ajá, yo le diría... Sol... El, el, el día. Ah, entonces ah. Friday, Friday, Friday. Friday October, first. October o first. October first. O, October, October Friday first. first. Digo yo que lo dejemos. Vaya. October sí. Friday. Vaya. October first. Y At le vamos a poner la hora o... Sí, at 2 p.m. 2 p.m. 2 p.m. Ok. A esa hora va a ser el check-in. ¿A qué hora de la tarde? 2. Ah. 2 <risa> p.m. Vaya. Y después dice... El agente pregunta cuántos días, ¿verdad? Ajá. Uh -huh. How long are you going to stay, stay with us? ¿Me voy a quedar cuántos días? ¿Cuántos días me van a pagar? El fin de semana le vamos a dar. Ok. <laughs> I'm going to stay until también until Monday o uh, sí, pues el fin de semana o until el domingo se va ah puede ir el domingo también until Sunday, Sunday. Until Sunday. Mm -hmm. 
¿Y será que...? Y no puede, que puede, puede tener algún requerimiento de usted. ¿De qué? Un amenities. Ah, por eso. Entonces usted me dice, eh, perfecto, su habitación, no, su, ¿cómo sería su? Está lista. Su reservación está linda, perfecto sería. Su reservación está lista. Entonces sería, perfecto, your reservation is is ready. Así sería. Perfect. Your reservation. Your. Is ready. Y por último yo le digo gracias. Reservation for single number room. Oh, really? Thanks. Uh, uh, do you need a single or double room? A uh, single room, please. Okay. We have a coffee service free to your room. Is there anything else I can help you with? I can repeat, please. Uh, we have a coffee service free to your room. Yes, I can serve you free to your room, please. Okay, thank you. <laughs> I'm a <good> <laughs> Service. Spa service. Mm -hmm. Spa service. Service. Oh. Um, other uh, laundry. Ajá. Uh -huh. Laundry service. Este buffet. Uh -huh. Ah, puede ser. Yes. I want to. Reserve. Discotec. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I want to. Yeah. 
Hasta ahí, Miren, una piscina de aguas termales también. No, eso Vaya no. El spa. Sí. sí, ¿verdad? El spa, sí, el spa service. ¿Cómo dijo, cómo dijo lo del salón de one. belleza? Beauty salón. Beauty salón. Salón. ¿Qué más? Ah, guía turístico. Ajá. Tourist guide. ¿Cómo? Tourist guide. Tourist guide. Tourist guide. Tourist guide. Yo como lo había puesto en mi checklist. Tour eh, guide. Yo le había puesto tour ya. guide. Que responda Ajá. ya porque no nos van a sacar y no terminamos. Ajá, cabal, y, y este, este <risa> nunca se pone en nada este, este cliente. Va, entonces ahora va a poner, dice, le vamos a poner a... Marry. <coughs> Algo difícil esto. Mary, room, please. Room, please. Bueno, hay que practicar. Bueno, está bueno. Dale. Good morning. Good morning. Amanecer model. I can you help you? Hello, I would like to make a reservation. How oh, many rooms and may I have your name, please? Of course, I, I am Nicolas Garcia. Thank you, Mr. Garcia. When are you going to arrive? I go to arrive at eight o'clock p.m. Okay. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Garcia? I'm going to study tomorrow. Okay. Are you going to make reservation for Marriott or singer room? My room, please. <laughs> Ok. Ah, pues terminamos. A ver, ya sé. Más o menos, la ¿no? Más o menos. Okay, now, now we're going to tell the conversation that you create. Okay, one of you will be the agent, and another one will be the client. Okay, uno será el agente y el otro el cliente, el customer. Okay, eh, no sé si tenemos voluntarios, volunteers. Only one, don't push, solo uno. Ok, mi Sonia Scrub. Let's start. Okay. Entonces, ¿quién? Porque estuvimos tres, teacher. ¿Cómo lo hacemos? Eh, ¿Los tres? Ok. Oh, los tres. Nos <risa> repartimos ahí. Okay. ¿Cómo lo vamos a repartir? Vamos así en Para orden quién. secuencial. Ok. Empecemos. Empiezo yo. Después Alex y después yo. Good morning. Thank you for calling El Amate Hotel. This is Sonia. How can I help you? Hello. I would like to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? 
Um, of course. I, I, I am have... excited on you. Thank you, Miss Alexa Mr. Alexander. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive in, on October 1st, 2 p.m. How long are you going to stay with us? I'm going to stay until Sunday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or double room? Are you going to request other service like? Uh, I, uh -huh. I do a room, please. Uh, I want to reserve a spa service uh, and uh, the tourist guide. Uh, Perfect. Yes, I want to reserve this bus service and need a tourist guide and double bed. Um, yo creo que ahí llegábamos, ¿verdad? <laughs> no, no dígale, dígale. No le dígale. pude pedir todo lo que yo quería, porque okay. yo quería a, a spa service, beauty salon, turquil. Uh, buffet, discotheque, buffet, <laughs> a lot of things. Oh, yes. I see. Okay, yes. uh, now Mr. Juan Alberto Rivas and Mr. Jose Nicolás. Thank you very much for your participation. Very good. Uh, Nicolás, está ahí? Yes. En Boco. Yes. Okay. Um, good night and amanecer or model and uh, can you help you? Hello, I going to like to make a reservation. How many rooms you need and may you have you you have name please? I call I am Nicolas Garcia. Thank you, Mr. Garcia. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive at 8 o'clock p.m. Okay. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Garcia? I'm going to stay tomorrow. Okay. Are you going to make the reservation for Marriott or single room? I might do, please. Okay, only that teacher. Okay, good. I like the name, Amanecer. Good, that, that is the hotel's name. Well, I'm sorry, the motel name because they switch. It is uh, Amanecer Feliz. Okay, excellent. Good job. Okay, now uh, let's see. Uh, the group composed by Mr. Edgar, Mr. Juan Menedemo, and Mr. Rona. Hello, thank you for calling to the Quality Hotel. How can I help you? Hello, Mr. Edgar. I would like a bad single room. Of course, we have four rooms available. Would you like Wi Fi, shareable service, swimming pool, or smoking room? No problem. This month uh, we're going to do reservation. No problem. This is, in this moment, we're going to do the reservation. Anything Thank else? You. Thank you, Edgar. Okay, no problem, sir. Okay, okay. good. <laughs> Straight to the point. Finish, right? Yes. Okay, thank you very much. Yes. Okay, now uh, let me see Miss Marisol and Miss Maritza, please. Teacher, uh, solo. 
que olvidamos ponerle el nombre del hotel. Ok, no importa. Okay. Okay, Ahí se lo okay. puede inventar en el camino. No, 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 nada, nos vamos a equivocar si lo inventamos. ¿sí? ¿Cómo? <ríe> ok, ¿está lista, Marisa? Yes. <ríe> ok. Hello, good morning. My name is Marisol Mingíbar. I would like to make a reservation. Hello, good morning. I am Marisa Reyes. How good I, I help you? I need a reservation for three days, Miss Marisa. Oh, on why day would you visit us? I would be on October 2nd at 9 in the morning. Miss Marisol, they roll to be single, single or double? A single room, please. Your reservation is ready. Thank you. Finish. Excellent. Your reservation is ready. Excellent. Okay, good. Muy bien. Okay. Eh, Mr. Nicholas. Eh, ah, he already passed. Miss Brenda, Mr. Samuel. Okay. Hello. Thank you for calling the Broken Bridge Hotel. This is Brenda. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course, my name is Samuel Tejada. Thank you, Jules. Thank you, Miss Tejada. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Thursday, 30. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Tejada? I'm going to stay until Friday, 8. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or double room? A uh, double room, please. My coworker is joining me. Okay. Are you going to need something else? Yes, please. I will need AC, Wi-Fi, internet, laundry service, and room service. Do you have these services? Of course. It's going to be a pleasure to serve you. Excellent. Thank you so much. Bye. A pleasure to serve you. you. Okay, excellent. Okay, good job. Okay, Mr. Samuel, thank you very much for your, for your participation. It's Brenda. Okay, uh, now, okay, let's go over the expression going to. Be going to. Okay, recuerden cuando decimos be, es porque vamos a utilizar el verb to be. Okay, por ejemplo, she is, he is, they are, we are. Okay, uh, going to is not a tense. It is a special expression to talk about the future. Okay, en la expresión el going to no es un tiempo gramatical, sino que es una expresión que, no se, que se refiere al futuro. Okay, going to. And uh, it is used with expressions such as, utilizamos ese tipo de expresiones, por ejemplo, tomorrow. Tonight, uh, next week, next month, next year, okay, um, in a few hours, in a few days, by next week, okay. Todas esas expresiones que ustedes pueden leer en la pantalla se refieren al futuro, okay. La siguiente semana, eh, ahora en la noche, la si mañana, el siguiente día, eh, en unas horas, en unas cuantos días, que okay, son expresiones que se refieren al futuro. Okay, entonces, esto nos ayuda también a identificar el, en qué tiempo estamos. Okay. ¿Cuál es la estructura de going to? Okay. The structure of going to. The structure is, for example, we have the subject. Okay. Miss Brenda, can you tell me the subjects that you remember? The subject. I'm going to help you out. I. They. 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 We. What else? She. She. she excellent, Miss. Okay. Tenemos los sujetos. We. Excellent. Como Miss Brenda acaba de mencionar. I, we, they, you. Y todos esos son los sujetos. En inglés siempre eh, utilizamos los sujetos a la hora de hablar. Seguido del verb to be. 
Okay, there to be is, for example, cuando decimos they are, she is, we are, eh, I am, okay, it is, okay. Después del de ver to be vamos a colocar going to, going to, más el verbo en infinitivo. Ok, si usted coloca, por ejemplo, usted dice I going to, está malo, porque no está mencionando el verb to be. Tenemos que mencionar, por ejemplo, I'm going to travel. She is going to eh, go to the party. Ok, tenemos que siempre mencionar el verb to be. Ok, siempre tiene que estar todo este informe, tiene que estar todos esos elementos, el sujeto, el verb to be going to y el verbo en su forma infinita. Ok, tenemos unos ejemplos. Eh, con, el suje, con el pronombre I, que significa en español, yo. Y decimos, eh, vamos a pedirle a Miss Maritza que lea el primer ejemplo, por favor. Can you read the first example, Miss? I am going to sing and they party. Ok, I'm going to sing at the party. 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 Okay. Eh, okay, Mr. Juan Ricardo. Venemos. Number two. She is going to sing at the party. Okay. Thank you very much. She is going to sing at the party. Ok, eh, Mr. Samuel, the third example, please. Ok, how about Mr. Jose Nicolás, the third example? He is going to assign his day party. Este es sing, cantar, sing. He is, sing. He He is going to sing at the party. Okay. At, repeat after me, at, at, at the party. At the party. Okay, Mr. Alexander, can you read the fourth example? It's going to rain. It is going, It is to, going rain. to rain. Excellent. Okay, Mr. Juan Alberto Rivas, you. And this uh, you're going, you are going to the sing. Okay, you are going to sing. To sing, sorry. Don't no worry. Okay. Are you, you are going to sing at the party. Excellent. Okay, Miss Sonia, next example. We are going to sing at the party. Excellent, very good. And finally, Miss Marisol, please. Okay. They are going to sing at the party. Perfect, Miss. Good job. Ok. Entonces, acá están los ejemplos. ¿Cómo, cómo vamos a utilizar el be going to? Ok. Todas estas oraciones significa, por ejemplo, que ella va a ir a cantar o ella irá a cantar a la fiesta. Ok. Por ejemplo, cuando utilizamos going to? Lo utilizamos cuando tenemos algún plan en el futuro. Por ejemplo, que usted se va a ir de, de viaje. De viaje el siguiente mes. Entonces podemos decir, I am going to travel to United States next month. ¿Ok? O vamos a decir que irá a visitar a sus padres, por ejemplo. I am going to visit my parents next week. Next week. Ok. Eh, ahora vamos a ver la forma negativa. Ok. La forma negativa. Y la forma negativa, eh, únicamente vamos a agregar eh, not. Not. Por ejemplo, I am not going to sing at the party. She is not going to sing at the party. You are not going to sing at the party. Pero también podemos utilizar la contracción. Las contracciones en she or you. Podemos decir, she isn't, she isn't going to sing at the party. 
también con you are. Podemos decir, you aren't, you aren't going to sing at the party. Okay, voy a colocar por acá la contracción para que también she isn't going to no sé si logran eh, ver la construcción. Yes, teacher. Yes, okay. teacher. She isn't going sí, sí. to sing at the party. Que okay. es lo mismo que usted diga, she is not. O con you aren't. You aren't. Es la contracción de you are not. Ok, vamos a ir completando estos ejercicios. Ok. Oh, I'm sorry. Vamos a ir. Primero. Eh, vamos a... Primero necesitamos el sujeto. ¿Cuál es el sujeto? I. I. I am. I am. I am going to, to work, work at the office. Okay. Tomorrow. Tomorrow, okay, podemos decir también. Tomorrow. Okay, pero vamos a dejar así. Podemos decir next day. Next day. Okay. Siguiente día. Okay, vamos con you dance salsa. You are. You are. You are. You are. Dance. You are going you are to going dance, dance dance salsa 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 okay it rain today it is you hit this rain today it is going to to rain today today it is Thank going to rain they today. are they are they are they are ask asking are a question to are going to ask a going to ask a question okay they are going to ask a question they he is, he is, he is going, going to, to stay. stay. He is going to stay. We are, we are, no, we are going to. We are going to speak. We are going to. Speak, speak um, French. 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 I am okay. going okay, 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 okay. I am going to. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, eh, vamos a darle la oportunidad a Mr. Ronald que nos ayude con la siguiente oración. Después a Mr. Juan Ricardo Menedemo con la siguiente. Mr. Ronald. Mr. Ronald. I am. Ok, good. I am going to give some candies. Excellent. Okay, Mr. Juan Minedemo. Uh, young. Mm -mm, next. Long. The next, next. Next. She. A young. Mm -mm. She. No. She. Mm -hmm. Dry. A young. No, hace falta el verb to be. She. She gone. She is. She is. I gone. Going. Three. 
stay so warm. To try. So warm. So warm. Software. Software. Okay. So Easy. Okay. Thank you, Mister. Okay, uh, Miss Marisol. Next, please. And they are going to help at home. Excellent. Very easy, right? Next sentence. Uh, Mr. Elvin, please. Teacher. Yes, they. He is going. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, can you repeat it again? He's going to push the door. Good, easy, Jesse. Okay, is there any question with the use of be going to? Alguna pregunta? Mm -hmm. Y si por casualidad tiene, digamos, el verbo to y el verbo eh, en base en una oración de going to, teacher, ¿qué se debe de hacer? Eh, pues es la instrucción. Se va a colocar going to de, y después el verbo en su forma infinita. Mm, infinita. O, eh, no, sin, o su forma base. En okay. el caso de chi, siempre tiene que ir ish, chi gong. Perdón. Eh, en el caso de chi, uh -huh. hay que regale ish. Exacto, mister. Siempre vamos a regalar el verb to be. Ajá. She is. En el caso de he, vamos a decir he is. En el caso de you, you are. En el caso de it, it is. It is. En el caso de they, they are. Okay, este they es are. el verb to be. To be. Ok. Pero ahí le faltó en they have home. Okay, uh, mm -hmm. let's start. He could, ahora va a ser sin escribirlo. Tiene que ir diciendo. Okay, <coughs> let's begin with number one with Mr. Alexander, please. He is going to cook dinner tonight. Excellent. He is going to cook dinner tonight. Dinner, dinner. Okay, number two, Miss Brenda. You? You are going to run in the race. Excellent. You are going to run in the race. Miss Carolina, number three. Okay, teacher. Uh, they, they are going clean. They they are going to climb that climb. mountain. That mountain, okay, climb that mountain. Okay, good, Mr. Edgar. She exercise at the gym. She's going exercise at the gym. She's at the going gym. to exercise at the gym. Excellent, next, Ms. Elvin. Mr. Elvin, you carry that heavy box. <clears throat> you are going to carry that heavy box. Good job, mister. Mr. Nicholas, computer crash. I am going to computer crash. crash. Okay, aquí estaba, uh, aquí el verbo es crash. Okay. Uh, Sería going computer is crash to. computing. I going, I going to crash computer. Okay, I'm going to crash the computer. Okay, good. Okay, next sentence, uh, Mr. Juan Alberto Rivas. We eat fish mm -hmm. tonight. We are going to eat fish tonight. Tonight, excellent. Lucy called a taxi. Miss Marisol, please. 
Lucy is going to call a taxi. Excellent. Miss Maritza Reyes, the last one. You sing a song for us. You, you are going to sing a song for us. For us. Good. Excellent. Ahora lo vamos a hacer en su forma negativa. Okay, recuerden, she isn't, they aren't. Okay, Mr. Wilmer, you begin, please. I'm not going to sell my car. Okay, I'm not I'm not going to sell my car. Good. Number two, Mr. Uh, Mr. Samuel, please, number two. Okay, uh, he is going to help us. Okay, negative, mister. Ah, uh, uh, sorry. He isn't going to help us. Help us, good. Excellent. Uh, Mr. Ronald, please, the third one. They study harder. What, teacher? No, the sentence number three, please. Three. Oh, okay, uh, sería... They they are not going to uh, study harder. Excellent. They aren't going to study harder. Good. Next, uh, Miss Marisol, we cook dinner tonight. Okay. Um, we are not going to cook cook dinner tonight. Excellent. Very good. Uh, next, Mr. Juan Ricardo Menedemo, please. I celebrate my birthday this year. I don't know how I celebrate uh, my birthday this year. Okay, primero colocamos el sujeto. Sí. ¿Cuál es el sujeto? Hi. Ajá. Hi. Hi. I don't know. I am I not. Know. Okay, I, I am know. not. I am not. To celebrate, celebrate my, my birthday this, this year. This year. Okay, good. She cleaning her room. I was gone. Uh, Mr. Juan Alberto Rivas. She cleaning her room. She she is in going to the cleaning. To her room. Okay, she isn't going. Okay, ¿cómo está el verbo ahorita? En ING, ¿verdad? En, Entonces, en, de clear, sorry, clear. Clean. Clean, sorry, clean. She isn't going to clean. She, her isn't, room. she isn't going to clean her room. Excellent. They move house. Um, Mr. Nicolas Garcia. They move house. They are not going to move house. Excellent. Move to house. Okay. She stay with Amy. Mr. Edgar, please. She isn't going to stay with Amy. Okay. Too sad. Okay. For him, Mr. Elvin, they change their clothes. La última, pero they... Antes. No, they aren't no change. Okay. They, okay. Aren't they, aren't, to, they aren't going to. They aren't going to change their clothes. Excellent. They are close. They are close. Okay. And finally, Miss Carolina, please. We are not going to get up up early next Sunday. Excellent. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, let's do the, this later. Okay. Okay, I'm sorry, give me a second. Okay, permítame, quiero, estoy abriendo otra presentación. Jueguito, teacher. Ya, ya casi, ya viene, ya viene. 
No son jueguitos, son practice, no jueguitos. Ok. Jueguitos, vamos, practice. Vamos con, vamos a practicar un poco el, el be going to. Ok. What are they going to do? They are going to sleep. Okay. They are going to sleep. I'm sorry. Camp. They are going to have camp. 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 What? It doesn't come up the word. She eats. What is going to happen? What is going to happen? Mm -hmm. ¿Qué es lo que va a pasar? It is going to happen. An accident. Is va a dar vuelta. Go. 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 Va a dar vuelta ese okay. microbús. Ok, pero en inglés. En inglés. Go. Back. Ok, they are going to have a crash. A crash. Ok, a crash. or they are going to have. Next. Okay, what, how what are you going to do? To go look, look. Okay, give me a second. No sé por qué no, no avanza bien esto. Permita. Look. Or Permita. see. Or watch. Permita. Okay, here we go. They okay. are they going are to sleep to, to a sleep camping. Okay, excellent. Now she is going she to a going to class. She, she to class. or he. He he she he is he is going to crash. No, hey, he okay. break. He's going. He's going to have an accident. He's going to have an accident. Okay, Tom. Tom is going. Is Tom is going. Tom. To Tom. Tom. Uh, clean. Wash, clean. Wash. Tom wash. is going to wash. Going to wash. Wash his or wash clean his car. His car. Wash. Tom is going to clean wash his car. Okay. He's going to yes. go late for work. Go late. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, sorry. Okay, eh, le vamos a dar la oportunidad a Mr. Menedema. He? He's... 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 He is? He is... Uh -huh. Con... Mm -hmm. So, uh, so arrive. arrive. Okay, he's going to be late for work. Wait. Okay, now, uh, Miss Carolina, please.
Uh, I'm sorry, I can't hear you, Miss. Your microphone. He is. Uh -huh. Okay. He is going to study in his in his English test. Está copiando. He's going to copy or oh. cheat on his English test, but it's okay. It's great. Okay, how about Mr. Jose Nicolás? I'm going to check in the kite. In the kite. Okay. Hacer, or bake, hornear, a cake. Next one, Miss Maritza, please. It is going to... No sé cómo se dice cuando está en la lluvia. Rain. ¿Cómo? Rain. 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 It is going to rain. Good job. It is going to rain. Okay. Um, Miss Brenda, please. She is going to uh, write, write a short story. Okay, Miss Marisol. We we are going to going to. No sé cómo se dice eso. <laughs> Going to travel. Travel. To Spain tomorrow. Drive. Drive. Conducir. Okay, okay. Mr. Alexander. He is going to He's going to? He's, he's going to have a shower. Have a shower. Take a shower. Take a shower. Take a shower. Okay, Mr. Wilmer, please. Yeah. He's going to fire. Is going to born himself. Okay. Um, Mr. Juan Alberto Rivas. He is going. Mr. Uh, he 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 is going to run the bus. To run the bus. Mm. Perder. Perder el bus. Okay. Él va a perder el bus. Mm. Ok. I think Miss Marisol said this one. Ok. Volunteer. I'm going to take a plane. Atrapar. Um, Mr. Samuel Isidro. Okay, Mr. Elvin. She's going. Hunting, hunting. Uh, 
and not teach. Is going to fall. Is going to fall. Is going to fall. Okay, Mr. Edgar, give it a try, please. Mr. Edgar? Uh, he's going to... Um, Give it up. Broke. Um, broke. Broke is fast. Break. Um, break. He's going to break. break. He's going to break every single one. Okay. Ok, esta fue una pequeña práctica de el Be Going To. Ok, muchas gracias a todos los que participaron. El día de mañana vamos a continuar eh, practicando esta Be Going To. Ok, vamos a tomar la asistencia. Este día vamos a iniciar con Mr. Carlos Albert. Eh, I'm sorry, Mr. Alexander Aron. Present teacher. Good. Eh, Ms. Brenda Lisef. Present. Carlos Alberto Segura. Miss Carolina Eleonor Cardona de Alvarado. Present teacher. Edgar Jose Cruz Amaya. Present teacher, have a good one. Thank you, Mr. You too. Elvin Alexander Alvarado Díaz. Present teacher. Ever Giovanni Ortiz. Ever Giovanni Ortiz. Miss Heidi Marisol Menjibar López. Present teacher, good night. Night, Miss Jose Nicolás García Maravilla. Present teacher. Juan Alberto Rivas. Present teacher. Juan Ricardo Alvarenga Alas. Juan Ricardo Menedemo. Present teacher. Thank you, Mr. Kenia Rebeca Navarro Medrano. Miss Maritza Reyes López. Present teacher. Miss Maritza. Ok, Miss Nora Lisset. Thank you, Miss. Mr. Ronald Alexis Gómez Mendoza. Mr. Samuel, Mr. Samuel Isidro Tejada Anaya. Sandra Quintanilla Solano. Sonia Miriam Cortés Vargas. Present teacher. Wilmer Fabricio Morales. Present. Good, excellent. Ok, este día le corresponde el, a Mr. Samuel el one-on-one. On one. Ok, the next, see you next class. Have a good one. Good night, everybody. Bye, good night. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. 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 bye, tomorrow. Ok. Ok, Mr. Samuel, como usted ya sabrá, esta es la sesión de los 10 minutos donde usted puede solventar alguna duda que tenga con respecto a las clases de gramática o alguna palabra eh, que a usted se le dificulte o algún tema en especial. 